pop it open, boom. Start to break them in half just like this. And we're gonna go ahead and hold off on the other side, okay? Just keep it there off to the side. There we go. And we're gonna go ahead and put some at the very bottom of the biscuit. So this is going to be our first layer, guys. We're gonna put this protein right there. And you know, if you do not make turkey during Thanksgiving, if you wanna do ham, ham will go so, so well in this as well, okay? There we go. Perfect. Now put as much of any of these ingredients as you want. You know, if you're more of a turkey person, put more turkey. If you're more of a, you know, mashed potato person, put more of that. It really does not matter as long as it tastes delicious to you. There we go. Now that we have that in there, we're gonna go ahead and grab our delicious stuffing, okay? Go ahead and start putting your stuffing right on top, just like this, as much as you love. Now, I am a huge fan of stuffing, so I usually like to put a good amount, but keep in mind, you know, you can do the stuffing with the cranberries in it and the walnuts, or you can do just more of a classic stuffing like I'm using right here. There we go. Now guys, if you're wondering, you know, how did I come up with making these? Well, I first got the idea because, you know, I am a huge fan of Thanksgiving, but it got to a point where I was just over the leftovers. So I decided, you know what, there's still so much left and I'm not wasteful, I wanna use them. So I decided to get some of these biscuits and make them into this and I have not looked back. We're gonna get mashed potatoes now. Now guys, by making this, it is just a game changer, okay? It is so, so delicious, so good. There we go. Perfect. Look at that. Amazing. Now, make sure to put these mashed potatoes in this order because we're gonna put something on top. And the way I'm doing this is for a certain reason, okay? Which I'll explain in just a second. Now, we're gonna go ahead and grab our veggies. We have some corn right here. And the reason why you put the mashed potatoes there is so this corn can go ahead and stick to it, okay? If we didn't have it there, the corn would definitely just kind of fall off and we do not want that to happen. There we go. Perfect. Amazing, check that out guys. Perfect. So now that we have this in here, we're gonna get the other side of our biscuit and we're gonna put it right on top. Okay, there we go. Perfect. You can kind of Press down slightly if you want, just to make sure it does not fall off. Perfect. Now guys, we're gonna toss these into the oven for 20 minutes at 350 degrees. Let them bake, get golden, and we'll take them out and make them even better. These are all ready to go, guys, so I went ahead and plated three of them. I let them cool first, that way it's not burning my hands, and I highly suggest you do the same. So. Now we're gonna go ahead and top it first off with some delicious gravy. It could be homemade, guys, or it could be store-bought. It does not matter as long as it is your Thanksgiving leftovers, okay? That is what I'm trying to help you make into an even more delicious way. Now we're gonna grab some cranberry sauce. We're gonna go ahead and put it right on top as well. Kind of spread it out, let it fall if it falls. Boom, look at that, guys. Perfect. As you can see, these look so, so delicious. And as a final topper, I always like to grab some chives because it really helps bring out a, you know, beautiful green color. There we go. Perfect. Amazing. Now, 
This is exactly how they should look when they're all prepared, guys. So delicious, so covered. And we're gonna go ahead and try them now. Take a look at these. Oh, ooh. Look at that cranberry sauce on uh -huh. that. Mm -mm. Is that homemade mashed potatoes? I it see? is. It is a Thanksgiving oh. biscuit. You are Used before I leftovers. It. Remember from our last Friendsgiving like two days ago? Really? Yeah, yes. Ooh, that's a good bite. Mm. <laughs> no, um. that's so good. The cranberry mm. makes it like the flavor pops so good. So that way it's not too like thick. Oh wow, wow, wow! It was so good with the gravy. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, that's amazing.